Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we have Harshwardhan here with us, who got into shop up as an intern and a full time employee this year. He is from VIT Chennai and he is a computer science student. He got this as an on campus placement. So before we talk to him, let's look at the eligibility criteria. So the eligibility criteria is that the student should have a minimum of 60% or 60 GPA in 10th and 12th as well as in the pursuing degree uh, if it's an undergraduate or postgraduate in both cases the CGPA should be a minimum of 6 or a percentage of 60% with no standing arrears. Now let's go ahead and talk to Harshwardhan here. Hi Harshwardhan, uh, welcome to my channel. Firstly congratulations. Thank you, thank you so much. Yeah, so could you introduce yourself first? Yeah, so myself, uh, I'm Harsha Vardhan. I'm a final year graduate from VIT Chennai. My major is in Computer Science Engineering. So basically my interest was all about learning the new technologies and uh, making some good projects throughout my career. So yeah, like finally I'm I have got an internship and a full time. I am glad to have some such a career, a start in the initial days. Okay, okay, cool. That's great. Uh, thank you for introducing yourself. You can now tell us about the hiring process. How many rounds were there and what they comprised of? Uh, so during the campus placements, there were many companies uh, that I have uh, gone through. But this the hiring process of this company was a bit difficult and. Uh, was a bit unique. It had uh, seven technical rounds. Oh, okay. Uh, and uh, one HR round, hmm. and, and one was the uh, the CEO round that was there, okay. but that didn't happen. So the first round was initially basically what we know is uh, analytical round that we have. Uh, they asked us the qu questions, basic questions were asked related to aptitude and everything. Okay. It was a one-on-one -on -one conversation between the. Uh, faculty, uh, person from the company and myself. So after that, they before that there was no written test or anything. Yeah, uh, no. Actually, for this company, the first uh, was uh, analytical round. Okay. So first, people who were shortlisted were uh, given a short uh, uh, rounds of uh, around five minutes or something. Okay. Okay. So this was basically was to categorize some people, I guess. Mm. So after this, we had the coding round. Okay. Yeah, the coding round consisted of four questions. Hmm. One was related to DSA and uh, other was uh, were the basic problems uh, related to Python or something. Any language we could choose. Okay. Yeah, so coming on to the third round. From the third round, it was uh, like a bit difficult on the parts. Okay. So after the coding part, there were, uh, there were like... Unknowingly, they were not known as the coding rounds, but they were technical rounds okay. as well as the other rounds. So okay. people uh, from the different posts from the company were assigned to the interviews. Hmm. So they came around and they we were having a live coding uh, session there, hmm. and we were given questions like uh, uh, some uh, shop shop models were given, hmm. and what is the waiting time of making a particular. Uh, customer that hmm. for getting a product something like that okay so after those interviews uh, we got a bit in between we had a hr round also okay so it was like basically they want to filter the few most of the people hmm. there hmm. so i think uh, 167 people were there in the start okay so at the end only four members were selected to the company okay yeah so Coming on to the father, the HR parts, they were asking the basic uh, uh, organizational ethics parts like how do we behave with the people, like mm. what do we do in some situations, situational rounds like that. Okay. And uh, after coming on to the next parts of the interviews, it was they, it was, they were like analytical rounds. They were asking about some uh, logical questions like there are 15 horses, there are uh, seven race race. Uh, Track, so what are the po possibilities like that so like puzzles kind of puzzles yeah yeah okay. so they were like so basically they tested each and every type of uh, knowledge that we need to have in the company okay okay so after how many rounds was the hr round after how many technical rounds yeah it's basically after four rounds there was a hr round after the, after the hr round, there were two more rounds again talk. yeah after four technical rounds hmm. it was a basic hr round 
and uh, after that there were uh, two uh, technical rounds hmm. that happened with the uh, chief uh, technical officer okay yeah so uh, up in that uh, even uh, like uh, there were two coding questions given to me okay. but uh, i couldn't uh, i couldn't code them in the period of uh, hmm. the coding process hmm. but they, they uh, actually the process the problems were a bit uh, high of complexity so they also offered an uh, idea of uh, passing the codes after the uh, interview process okay okay hmm. yeah so they have given a deadline of 1 o'clock hmm. the interview was scheduled at 10 o'clock hmm. so 10 to 11:30 it was like one and a half hour to two hours it was uh, happening between me and ceo okay so then he said that it's fine the logic is good but the working process was a uh, like uh, the compiling hmm. was not happening hmm, hmm. so they've given a grace period of some uh, one hour or something okay so then uh, i have uh, sent my working codes gracefully uh, i got to i made to run the codes so and then they are they have called me they asked like uh, we have a front end role opening for us hmm. and are you okay with it working so the best first opportunity best opportunity hmm. so i was really glad about it so i okay. said yeah sir i will work my best to do the front end Okay. Then they said this is not confirmed. We are just talking to you. Mm-hmm. Uh, don't think that this is the final result. Mm. After a few days on my mother's, uh, my, on my parents' marriage anniversary day, I got the results. So I got okay. Results on December third. Okay. 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 That's great. Congrats again. And thank you. Thank you so much. Wish yeah. You. Yeah. Thank you for sharing your experience. Do you have any suggestions or tips for people who want to get in? Yeah. It's all about like uh, we need to know what do what we want to do in the life it's mm. not all about like you just join a job do some make some earnings or mm. something like that it's like uh, what you make some changes in your life mm. it's basically uh, how you want to build your path of your career mm. uh, so basically now that is why the issue is like i i would like to go for higher education and improve the technical skills that i have mm. so according to me it's not uh, like uh, it's not only the path of doing a job mm. or something like that but it's all about learning and uh, having fun in whatever work we do yeah correct right okay uh, that's great thank you again for sharing and-